Guys, if I may, I'd like to open this review by paying my respects to Anton Yelchin. While his career has come to a sad and tragic early end, it has definitely gone out on a high note with this movie. Star Trek Beyond, directed by Justin Lin, starring Chris Pine, Zachary Quinton, Anton Yelchin, Simon Pegg, Zoe Saldana, Carl Urban, and Idris Elba. So Star Trek Beyond is set about a couple of years after the events of Into Darkness, and we see now that this Enterprise crew is a very tight unit, as Kirk is given something which sets the wheels in motion for a, an attack of epic proportions from Idris Elba's character. Now Chris Pine has really found his footing very well in the role of Kirk and has an amazing chemistry with the entire crew and it's nothing short of magnificent. In fact the entire cast just give absolutely standout performances and they really do manage to celebrate this franchise's 50th anniversary extremely well by paying tribute to the classic series but also taking this new phase of the franchise into a new direction. Speaking of tributes, the way they pay tribute to the original Spock, Leonard Nimoy, is extremely clever and very well handled. Also the action sequences are very well utilised as well. The makeup effects look on the different alien races look absolutely magnificent and the best thing is it all looks practical with what looks to be very little use of CGI. The makeup effects look on the different alien races look absolutely magnificent and the best thing is it all looks practical with what looks to be very little use of CGI. And this movie is also really funny and had me laughing at certain moments. And the score for this movie is one of the best I have heard in years, particularly a certain scene when the Enterprise isn't looking so good. Plus, even though this is the third movie in what is a very successful new franchise, you can go into this one without seeing the previous two, as it does manage to be its own self-contained story. The only problem I really had with this movie is the fact that the first act did take a while to get going though. But overall, I had a lot of fun with this movie, and I'm definitely looking forward to more. My final verdict is a 9 out of 10. Thanks for watching this guys as always, now it's over to you so feel free to comment below and tell me what your thoughts are on Star Trek Beyond and as always if you are new to my channel feel free to click here to see more and subscribe as I do make new videos as often as I can and still to come are my reviews for the BFG which will be coming tomorrow and then I will be at an exclusive screening for Batman The Killing Joke on Monday night so expect that review to be coming by Tuesday. So as always guys, I shall see you all on the next one and take care.